Morning everybody, it's Monday morning in Lake Como. That was a bit of a rough night, wasn't it? It was a little bit, yeah. Oh. Morning. Good morning, yes. Well, after you went last night, we watched the fireworks, because we were able to. And um, during the night, we had some natural fireworks again, didn't we? Thunder and lightning and everything was Every going rain. on. Mental. Yeah, so that's that. Right, what we got to do now, in a few minutes, we've got to go down to the hotel and do our collection and do several collections because I'm a ferry truck and then we get our own load and that goes straight back to the UK so we've got a bonus really because we're going to be back Wednesday with a bit of luck instead of Saturday yep. which is good because someone else has got to do the other load which is going to be going out of Belgium do that. so we're out of that equation so it's good and it's stopped raining now the sun's out <laughs> That's here. Oh, Our work here is done. That's it. Final trip to the hotel. Yep. Final load being taken out. How are we doing like that way? Yep. Cool. Right. Angie has to look right because that's a blind corner. I can push my mirrors out with the button, but it's easier to trust your wife, isn't it? Final, um, final trip through the little narrow street. This is why the little truck has to come down here because you imagine coming down here with a big one, you'd be knocking all these signs and lights oh, down please. and all these people walking here. Look, I don't hardly get back when you're coming through with a little truck, but there you go. I just look confused as normal. That's the last time we see that with a bit of luck. <laughs> Thing. Yeah. Gavin said to me, see you next year. I thought, no you won't. Well, who knows? Hit this tree for the last time. Nice. nice. Go back, get this off, and uh, oh, there's a little lime greeny smarty there, look. Street green. Yeah. Proper. Left hand drive. Left-hand drive, out here, <laughs> idiot. Well, this is God intended, isn't it? They're meant to be left-hand drive. There's a beautiful place, though, isn't it? It's gorgeous. It would be nice to come here when all this event stuff ain't going on, wouldn't it? Lovely, wouldn't it? This is expensive. Though. Our work here is now done, isn't it? Mm. Been a bit of a delay waiting for our load. Yeah. Everybody else is gone except us. So we're just gonna have a little snack and then hit the road. I don't know how far we'll go tonight because it's now half past three. 25 past three local time. Anyway, that's the way it goes isn't it? Yeah. At least it's not raining like last night. And this morning. Mm. And they were doing stuff in the rain as well. Mm. Yeah, we did it right, didn't we? And it was cool enough to do that running backwards and forwards without getting too hot. That's it then. We're leaving Como now. And um, down via Milan, Turin, towards Fraser's Tunnel. It's about three and a half hours to Fraser's Tunnel. Um, but that's it, isn't it? What'd you say? Come over. Come over. Bye come. bye. Bye bye come over. Come over. Bye bye Bennett. After 200 yards at the roundabout. Yeah, good coffee in there. So I have to turn right out of that road because you can't turn left. Round this roundabout and then back on ourselves and out. Idiots! No idiots! Oh. <laughs> Absolute idiots! They don't seem to bat an eye. No. Milano. Bennett's. Yeah. Right 
Smarties out of there, though. Same. Yeah, and the one in there. Yeah, that's the other one. How are we doing? Yeah, yeah. Stupid stop sign, all bloody worn out. That's it, we never see Como again. After 700 yeah. yards, keep uh, left. Just arrived at Fraser's Fraser's Tunnel, whatever you want to call it. Fraser's Tunnel. <laughs> That'll take us back from Italy through to France. That's a good run, wasn't it? Yeah. So three hours twenty-one minutes to the tunnel. How about that? That's good. No queue. And the road leading up here is just like we're the only ones on it. It's not like Mont Blanc, is it? It's like the wacky races going up there.
I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to get it to a person. I don't know. Where are you going that one? Is that, is that open? That's it. That's easy, isn't it? Look at that car train's got in front of us again. That is true. How did that work? Here we go. Traforo de Fragus. run wasn't it? Fantastic. Yeah we've done Excellent. three hours 55 minutes to um, I've still got to read it I just said where we was. St Julian Mont Denis. I do love the French accent you Mont Denis. St Julian Mont Denis. Mont Denis. You know where we stopped on the way up on the way down actually uh -huh. before the um, Fraser's tunnel in the holding area but we're in the services on the other side and when we stopped here the other night this part of the services only about three vehicles in it mm. it's quite busy tonight isn't it yeah um, it's a bit of space. so yeah so we've we're stopped we're only having a break aren't we oh yeah yeah we're not stopping here overnight because it's all on the all on the like that it's all on the tilted yeah so mm -hmm. you'd have to get your wood out <laughs> <laughs> and put under the wheel oh, that's painful anyway um, yeah so we've got to do at least three more hours because I don't want to be stuck in no man's land in <coughs> France about two hours from Calais tomorrow mm, no, we don't. <coughs> which is very dodgy I want to be able to get far enough up the road today to be able to make awful trucks in Calais for tomorrow night and then start with a clean card on Wednesday mm. but this ain't bad in here is it we stopped for a lovely little cup of coffee nice yeah. comfy little area to sit yep nice chairs yeah bought ourselves a baguette the last one for later yeah um what Not else it, that really. tunnel was this route is the best mm, flat yeah hardly so, any traffic no it's like us being on the road on our own, wasn't it, half the time? Straight to the payage, straight to the booths as you go into the tunnel. And that was three and a half hours from Lake Como to uh, France. Out of the, spat out the end. I'll come this way again, I think. Well, I can't, they can't guarantee it being like it all the time, can you? But I think it's the best way to come. I can't good. guarantee anything in this job. No, every trip's different, isn't it? So, um... Right, uh, well we've got another 10 minutes and then we're going to crack on, aren't we? Yeah. 
It's gonna be a late finish tonight because we got held up at Como, didn't we? Waiting for our load. Last one's out, aren't we? Typical. So never mind. At least we're gonna be on Wednesday now instead of Saturday and work through Friday night, which is what the plan was before, wasn't it? Somebody else has got to do that now. <laughs> never mind. Hey Gary. Right. That's the way the cookie crumbles, <laughs> as they say. Gary International. That's an in-joke. You know, when he watches it. If he watches it. <laughs> right, then we're going to have another five minutes and then we're going to crack on. Shower the horse, we're done. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's too late. It's 11 o'clock and we're just having something to eat and a drink. Mm. Um, I needed to get within striking distance of Calais, as you know. And we've got, we've got within nine hours, 45 minutes of Calais, which is a bit tight. I wanted to get a bit closer, but it was getting too late and I'd had a gut load and uh, we found a little place to squeeze in in one of the services because um, if you go down further you might not or up further or wherever it, wherever it is I don't know and then you get spat out the other end just yeah so we just thought well nine and three quarter hours it's doable as long as you don't get held up normally that sort of time so we nibble a bit off of that as the day goes on. So it's better be a bit nine and a half hours to get into all for trucks at Calais. So that's going to be it. We're just going to have a bit of um, cheese and tomato roll and a couple of little bits of wine, and um, that's it. And we've got our friendly fridge man near us as well, mm. but we didn't have no choice. We thought we got away with it, but yeah. once started up, didn't it? Yeah, it's nice and peaceful when we squeezed in behind this other truck, but then we had the dreaded whistle and then. God, it's so depressing. I it starts it. playing a tune. Oh, it's like when you spray a fly with fly spray, isn't it? Yeah, it's good. It goes. <laughs> Bloody fridge. Oh, God, I don't know. Anyway, on that bombshell. We're going to have about half an hour of downtime and then go to bed and um, see what tomorrow brings us. Hey. Not a lot of you punching the tarmac, wasn't it? Mm. Up to Calais. And then that's it. So, anyway, thanks for joining us, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. And give us a thumbs up, subscribe, press that bell next to the subscribe button, and um, tell your friends if you want. And we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> thanks for joining us. See Cheers. you later. Bye.